Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Crusader Kings 2. We're a day late and really late at night, uh, so we have a different audience tonight, uh, just because I was not free yesterday, and this is when I'm free. My voice might sound a little bit shot for these four episodes slash this stream, just because I've been recording for like three hours of laughing and yelling a lot, and so uh, my voice is quite sore. It's probably going to sound really awful for a long time because I need to record five or six days in a row. Not even counting today. Seven if you count today. So we last left off. We are still trying to make more headroom in, uh, in you know, trying to found Jerusalem properly here. So that's what we're going for right now. Uh, it's still this guy. How? What's our truce with him again? We actually don't have a truce with him now. Okay. I could just border dispute but it's really expensive to border dispute. At the same time, though, fabricating a claim costs basically the same thing. We barely lose any piety. You know what? Considering how expensive a fabricated claim is in the first place, we might just border dispute them. Uh, tempting. Very tempting. He has, like, no troops. Let's border dispute. Yeah. Is this a new game from the last one? No. This is like episode 140 something. Anyway, uh, let's, uh, which one do I want a border dispute for actually? We need, um, if we do kingdoms, yeah, to make Jerusalem, we actually need all of this land. So... If we break this into duchies, because if I can create a duchy, that gives me a claim. Um, so it breaks up into these bits. Okay, so I don't have any of the land for that. For Jerusalem... Yeah, we can't make any of that yet, can we? Let's de jure. Yeah, all the things we can make are, are in the west. Okay. Uh, this is rough. I don't really have a clear one to grab here. Because if I grab that, then I've already got the whole thing. I can't usurp this because he's at war. Otherwise, I would just usurp it. So that's not the best pick right now. What is this one again? See, that goes into some of that land, which... Uh, Al Jazeera's land, which is much more powerful. So that's the last place we want to take. Um, we probably just want some of this then... Yeah, well, what's this part of? Yeah, we don't have any of that land either. Okay, so there's no piece we can grab that would really help us with getting, like, usurping a Dejure Duchy. So. Yeah, I think we're going to just declare then. What border one is the best one financially? Oh, this is Silk Road. We want that. Oh, this one's also quite good in Silk Road. Okay, this one's worth more, in fact. Yeah, I want to take this one. Safid. We will declare for Safid. Let's just make sure that we have some troops next to it first. That up there, that over there, and that'll be good. Check if any is a holy city. Um, no. No, none of the holy cities are super, super close. Although none of them are super far away either. The farthest one is out by, like, Oman. Which is decently far, but not horrific. The farthest one is this, I believe it is. It's either this one or this one. One of those two. Thanks for all the follows, by the way, guys. Sorry, I'm going to have a hard time keeping up with that. I want to really keep my focus on the game, so I'll be mostly trying to read stuff from the chat that's giving advice and whatnot. I don't want to get t super um, distracted just because... Uh, I already am a bit brain fried this week. Okay, let's declare. So I want a border dispute for Safid. Oh, right, I don't have enough money. It's okay, we, we only need to save up like a couple months of money or something. We don't even need that much. Oh, we're trying to assassinate a guy? Wasn't it so that we could save money on the Republic re-election? Was that it? Vassal, yeah. <clears throat> 
nice glasses. I'm surprised I'm getting that so much. Yeah, I, I wear these every once in a while. It's just for if my eyes are really bothering me. It's to um, reduce the yellow light from the, or sorry, the blue light from the monitors. Did not know the name of his killer. Sweet, we killed him. And we inherited land that I don't want. Uh, what did we get? A bunch of land, actually. Uh, we don't need to give all of it away right now, though. What's the least valuable here? This one. We will give it to... Rabbi? Rabbi. We need to thank him for converting. Must be able to marry and then produce. Oh, never mind. I wanted to give it to him because he, he converted Jerusalem for us and it was so useful. Okay, our steward then. He's very talented. We'll give it to him. There you go. Uh, it's pronounced su Zufot is how you pronounce Safid. That's ridiculous. <laughs> okay, weird. Okay, right, we gotta save a little money. We're almost there. Uh, that's not the rabbi who did it. That's the one, right, because the one who did it died. That's right. Uh, Lord of the Dragon Empire, who's one of our daughters. Uh, maybe she'll make a good steward someday. Militia training ground done. Beautiful. We have a lot of buildings about to finish. I might manually upgrade these uh, tribes, actually. Because it is pretty cheap to at least upgrade the hill forts a little for the next stoner to upgrade to feudalism. Because my god, do we still have a lot of tribal land. Which is just insane. Uh, yeah, let's border dispute for it. God, that's so expensive, but it's almost the same price as fabricating a claim. And fabricating a claim is a bit luck-based anyway. Will you do another playthrough of Guild 2? Probably one day, but I already did like eight or something. All right, war is declared. Okay, we'll do that. And then he can, yeah, that guy leading the center. I'm happy with that. Okay. Let's try and get a quick war done. Court done, good, that's money. Right, and how's the respect going on this? Can I uh, lower it? Not really, no. I'd have to kill this guy. Uh, how easily could I kill him? Really easily, without even paying anyone, is 200% plot power. Okay, kill him. Another court done. Good, that's more income. Uh, what counselor is in Iraq? Uh, he's fabricating claim. He's not super talented, but we don't have a replacement. Could we real quick get a good replacement? Not even close. What is this? Uh, after many years uh, dedicated to the Hermetic Society before missions, blah, 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 rewarded. I've become the new Magus! Oh my god, already? Wow, that was quick. We are the new Magus. This is the second time we've controlled a Magus of the of the um, Hermetic Society. Awesome. That's more learning for us. And thus, better tech rate. University built, good. That's more economic advances. Okay, our economic tech points are really good right now. That's awesome. This quick, you're what, 27? Uh, 27, you got it. I don't know how the hell you remembered that. Mm. Do I want to keep saving up for... You know what? We're really close to another level, level of cities and temples. The next one is a lot of upgrades, including cathedral schools. That would be more tech for, I believe, cultural tech. Reputation's ruined. Oh no, people know that I'm trying to murder. That's like the 50th time. Trade practice is always nice, but I think we just want to get that level of city and temples. That's really powerful. Don't point that thing at me. We're going to try and kill him with a viper. Randy Orton, RKO. Read the book. Get diplomacy. It's in the book. That's a dumb reference. Okay, become a falconer instead. Good but bad. Okay, we've killed, but we're a known murderer. Yes, known murderer. Oh no. Here we go. We have a big respect lead now. We'll do that. We just got 500 bucks back. So let's upgrade these tribes. Oh, they already have fully upgraded hill forts and markets. Are you kidding me? The owner of these places are just lazy and didn't bother upgrading it any more than that. Are you kidding me? God damn it. They got to modernize already. Okay, I just gave this guy the thing, so there. I'm gonna help him reinforce that hill fort faster, I guess. 
Hope that maybe he gets his act together. Wow, we are almost done these upgrades. We're 97% done level three of Manbar's Institute of Higher Learning. The Wolgast Harbor is also not super far off. Let's save up a little bit of money then. So that the moment we, um, the moment we're done upgrading those, we can get going on new features for them. I'm surprised we even have 40 people watching right now, considering I never stream this insanely late at night and I have a very Europe-centric viewer base. Lost our Spymaster. I think our Spymaster was a family member, too. Okay, get this guy. He's probably a pagan, but whatever. Another Carpathian Slavic Revolt this is the 16th one. How quick are we going to put this one down? It's nothing. Also, do we have a levy raised? No, I think we just inherited some random um, retinues there. Forgot we were stealing land up in here. Uh, you know what? Grab all of that and just go there. I'm just going to use my personal levy to deal with this. Okay, cool. He showed up. Get a new spy master. And I think I'll just have him scheme because people are probably plotting to murder us anyway. So I need that defense. Okay. Um, and then I want my armies down here. I do need to hit that group in a moment when I'm done the siege. Here we go. Okay. Knock them out like they're nothing. And then we'll return and keep sieging that place, because it's worth most of the war score. Oh, have we stolen something? Beautiful. We have stolen some Zhao artwork. That is probably pretty good. Isn't that the second Chinese artifact that we've stolen from Iraq? They must have good relations with... Uh, yeah, because we also have the tapestry. And now we also have some artwork, which is not quite as good. It's not amazing, but uh, it's free. Can I give it back to China? No, it's not high enough quality, I guess. Shame. It would be pretty incredible if I could. Change the laws to increase army or money from our people. No, I already have all of that done. I'm a falconeer. Yes, because diplomacy and same trade opinion. It's a very minor buff, but it's a buff. Damn. Not here. Thanks for the uh, Twitch Prime sub there, Jacob B. Enjoy your dumb emotes of my dumb face. Okay, what have we got here? The Wormwood strategically placed... Hold on. Put down my, like, 32 vassal levies so I don't piss off a random mayor. I forgot about that. Uh, da, 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 da. Perhaps I should take precautions too. Oh, right. Precautions against evil spirits and stuff. Uh, yeah, just wormwood. I don't mind. Just get rid of some small, insignificant uh, ingredient. Will you do another playthrough of the guild too? I already answered that for you. The answer is maybe. I don't know, but I've done like eight playthroughs of that. And sorry, catcher can, catcher can learn on his own. Intrigue focus is your favorite. Intrigue focus is really fun, especially if you're not the leader of the country. Because you get a lot of, uh, there's a lot of mileage out of, like, climbing up in your country through intrigue focus. So I find it really fun. Oh. I won that war, and I never paid attention to it. Did I accidentally bump into them? Probably. There we go. Okay. Okay. Will you play Evil Genius again? I already let's played it fully twice. I don't... I Maybe someday in a really long time. Generally, the answer when you're asking me to let's play a game I've already let's played is... Probably no. Maybe in a really long time. If I really feel like it. Ooh, gotta take care of that. Just go there and walk back. We don't even need a commander on that. We have such better true quality, man. Temples finish construction. I was not building a temple there, but that's fine. Just create a new vassal for that. And construction level three, Manbar's Institute of Higher Learning. Beautiful. 
Someone else must have been building that. Okay. Okay, levy size 10%, economic tech points, intrigue, focus, or intrigue, diplomacy, stewardship, and cultural tech points, and monthly prestige. God, that building has gotten so good. So we can fit another two um, features, but before we do any of that, we gotta get a head start on stage four, which is the final stage of any wonder, uh, just because that takes forever. And it's gonna give a lot of tech points. That's really nice, isn't it? Will you play Middle Age Shadow of War? I don't even know what that is. Um, are you planning on doing Mankind Divided after Human Revolution? Maybe at some point. I, so, I, I'm so not used to, like, everybody asking me questions all of a sudden. I'm confused. Uh, how much is it? I just drop, like, a, I drop under a thousand to get it started. Let's just get it started now, then. And available. Right. What can we do here that I actually really still want? Marshall wouldn't be bad. Learning wouldn't be bad. Marshall is more troops. And troops is stability. We're going to get a wing of strategy, probably a wing of technology after for the learning. And then I don't know what we're going to do after that. Um, get that building. There we go. God, wonders are such a fun mechanic. I'm so happy they added that. And it's crazy to think they added that for free. This is your first time watching live? That's awesome. I hope you have fun. Sorry, it's kind of like a random late night low energy stream. Oh, we have a rash. I hope we don't have anything serious. It's just, uh, oh, we got treated well. Okay. Um, it's just, it's kind of a special stream. Show the religious, cultural, frontier map modes, integer empires. I'm surprised why, oh, we got rid of the rash. I guess it was really minor. I don't know why you'd want to see de jure empires, but sure. So this is a breakdown of de jure empires in the game. Um, of de jure ones, I think the only ones cur that currently exist are Carpathia, which is us, Byzantine Empire, and Holy Roman. I think, oh, in Tibet, right? Yeah, Tibet exists. Yeah, those are the only de jure empires that have actually been founded. Although Sweden is getting pretty close to getting Scandinavia. So they're pretty dangerous. Okay. Back to the war, though. Rash? Cancer. In this game? Probably. Let's, uh, since we're taking this anyway, we'll get a preemptive fort on that. Why not? Has a hospital in here again? Good, but the tech is holding it back. Not a whole lot we can do about that right now, though. The tech on our capital is amazing, but our capital is very far away from Jerusalem. And you can't really willingly change your capital here anyway. I mean, we could potentially change it to Jaffa, I think. If you change your main title, your primary title, you can change your capital um, to whatever is related to that. But the, the capital of Jerusalem would be Jerusalem, I believe. So even if we change that to our main title, I don't think it would be the same. How much of the population have converted to Jewish? Almost none. Like three counties of our, uh, I believe it's this number. So 300, no, that's vassal number, but not direct. Is it? No, realm size. We're 303 counties, I believe. Or I believe baronies might count as well. I don't remember. News from China. They are enforcing tributary state. Okay. Okay. Just making sure it's not an emperor dying, because if they close the Silk Road, that hurts our income. Okay, important decision, acquire ingredients, sure. Pretty much no reason not to do that if you're just doing something safe like the hills. And is he willing to give in yet? No. We already got that murder done, right? We're not trying to murder right now? I try to murder so many people that I have to forget who I'm trying to murder. Some random kingdoms are Jewish. Yes, we did convert a couple, not kingdoms, but small tribes to Judaism. 98, still, still not willing to give. This war right here, that battle right there will probably end it. Yep, we're at 100. 
Easy, quick war. Got a piece of land that we needed. And we're threatening again. Ooh, that's actually a lot of threat. 